of the 2,252 individuals that received these therapeutics in North Dakota, the majority of them over age 65, many with underlying uh, symptoms or underlying uh, conditions, only 22 or less than 1% have been hospitalized, uh, which supports the decreased risk of po hospitalization post-infusion that we'd previously heard about uh, from the Mayo Clinic study, which was at 2%, so this is even better than that. And so one of the keys to the success of, of this helping drop our numbers of hospitalizations has been uh, ensuring that healthcare providers and the both healthcare providers uh, that would administer these infusions and the newly identified COVID positive individuals are aware of the treatment's availability and aware of its effectiveness and its safety. Uh, and so again, uh, thanks to all at the North Dakota Department of Health, thanks to all of our medical providers that continue to spread the word uh, through education, public service announcements and others, because like the vaccine, these are truly life-saving uh, therapeutics.